If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell icon to get the latest updates. Question Which of the following features are provided by the SAP Fiori Launchpad Content Manager? Note There are three correct answers to this question. Option 1 Activate Zero Data Services. Option 2 Create and Configure Groups. Option 3 Display Role Assignments for Catalogs. Option 4 Display the Issue with SAP Fiori Launchpad Content. Option 5 Create and Configure Catalogs. Question, in SAP NetWeaver as Java, the user management engine, UME, supports which of the following data sources for storing user data? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Java System Database. Option 2 Directory slash USR slash SAP. Option 3 UDDI Provider. Option 4 ABAP based SAP system. Option 5 LDAP Directory. Question, what is the main purpose of SAP Access Control, as an enterprise software solution? Option 1 Manage corporate social media presence. Option 2 Secure authentication for cloud and on-premise. Option 3 Deployment of encryption services. Option 4 Identify security risk and document compliance. Question, which values are permitted for the S underscore BTCH underscore job authorization object? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 show. Option 201, create. Option 3 RELE. Option 4 DELE. Option 502, change. Question, you want to limit an authorization administrator so that they can only assign certain authorizations. Which authorization object should you use? Option 1 S underscore user underscore AGR. Option 2 S underscore user underscore val. Option 3 S underscore user underscore ADM. Option 4 S underscore user underscore TCD. Question, which of the following functionalities are supported by SAP Information Lifecycle Management, ILM? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Data Archiving. Option 2 Data Logging. Option 3 Data Retention. Option 4 Alert Notification. Option 5 Data Destruction. Question, which of the following accurately describe a composite role? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 Transaction cannot be deleted from the menu with authorizations retained. Option 2 User assignment is maintained at the composite role level. Option 3 Menus cannot be adjusted as required. Option 4 Authorization are maintained on single role level. Question, which of the following accurately describes solution manager functionality? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Configuration validation can check if security policies were applied. Option 2 Configuration validation helps to standardize and harmonize security related configuration items for ABAP systems only. Option 3 SAPAVA provides the most comprehensive security check. Option 4 SAP SOS self-service is a convenient entry point to introduce security monitoring. Option 5 A system recommendation provide a work list of potentially relevant security notes.
question, which archiving object can you use for archiving changed documents related to changes with authorizations assigned to user? Option 1 us underscore prof. Option 2 us underscore off. Option 3 us underscore pass. Option 4 us JJ sir. Question, when building a PFCG role for SAP Fiori access on an embedded front-end server configuration, which of the following item should be provided? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 SAP Favorites. Option 2 Catalog for the start authorization. Option 3 UI access to the apps. Option 4 Start authorizations for zero data services. Option 5 WAPA Business Server Pages Question, a PFCG role can be linked to an SAP organizational management structure by which object types? Note. There are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Job Option 2 Person Option 3 Organizational Unit Option 4 Task Option 5 Position Question, which of the following are system security threats? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Authority Violation Option 2 Non-Repudiation Option 3 Code Injection Option 4 System Penetration Option 5 Availability Question which configuration options apply to the usage of vClient in the parameter ICM slash server underscore port underscore XX? Note. There are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 vClient default value is 0. Option 2 vClient value must be specified if SSL configuration is defined by SLConfig. Option 3 vClient default value is 1. Option 4 vClient equals 0 which notifies the SSL server that no SSL client verification is needed. Option 5 v client equals 1 the server asks the client to transfer a certificate. Question, which of the following phases in SAP audit management auditing process? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Mitigation Review Option 2 Engagement Planning Option 3 Remediation Analysis Option 4 Communication Results Option 5 Monitoring Progress Question, which of the following are used in SAP Enterprise Threat Detection? ETD, architecture. Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 SAP HANA Smart Data Streaming. Option 2 SAP IQ. Option 3 Forensic Lab. Option 4 SAP ASE. Question. You are configuring authorizations to secure access to table data using transaction SM31 and you encounter authorization object S underscore taboo underscore dis and field dikeperkles. How can this field be used to secure access? Option 1 It allows you to specify access to tables associated with a specific authorization group. Option 2 It allows you specify access to specific client dependent table. Option 3 It allows you specify access to a specific client independent table. Option 4 It allows you specify access to tables referenced by a specific program group.
question, which of the following authorization objects would be required to allow back-end server access to a Webdin Pro application using the SAP Fiori launchpad? Option 1 S underscore code. Option 2 S underscore start. Option 3 S underscore service. Option 4 S underscore personas. Question, the report search for application in role menu can be called via which of the following options? Note. There are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 transaction SUIM, menu node roles. Option 2 transaction RCSR underscore role underscore menu. Option 3 transaction RCSR underscore start underscore APPL. Option 4 transaction SUIM. Menu node change documents. Question, which transaction codes are relevant to enable SNC between ABAP system? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 RZ10. Option 2 SNCO. Option 3 Strust. Option 4 PFCG. Option 5 SU01. Question, what information can be provided by an audit class? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Dialog Logon. Option 2 RFC slash CPIC logon. Option 3 transaction start. Option 4 user roles. Option 5 user authorizations. Question. Which application allows a role developer to perform the mass maintenance of menu options from selected SAP Fiori title catalogs? Option 1 PRGN underscore print underscore AGR underscore menu. Option 2 PRGN underscore compare underscore role underscore menu. Option 3 PRGN underscore create underscore Fiori underscore front end role. Option 4 PRGN underscore create underscore Fiori underscore back end roles. Question, which of the following are used in SAP Enterprise Threat Detection, ETD, architecture? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 SAP HANA Smart Data Streaming. Option 2 SAP IQ. Option 3 Forensic Lab. Option 4 SAP ASE. Question, a PFCG role can be linked to an SAP organizational management structure by which object types? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 A dot job. Option 2 B dot person. Option 3 C dot organizational unit. Option 4 D dot task. Option 5 position. Question, which of the following app-specific types of entities do users need to use SAP Fiori apps? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1A, Master Data. Option 2B, UI. Option 3C, Authorizations. Option 4D, Parameters. Question, which of the following conditions apply when merging authorizations for the same object? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1A, changed authorizations can be merged with manual authorizations, even if the activation status is different. Option 2B, changed authorizations can be merged with manual authorizations, 
as long as the activation status is the same. Option 3C, both activation status and maintenance status of the authorizations match. Option 4D, both activation status and maintenance status of the authorizations do not match. Question, which of the following objects allows you to restrict which users can distribute a role to another system using an RFC destination? Option 1A, S underscore user underscore AGR. Option 2B, S underscore user underscore SYS. Option 3C, S underscore user underscore AUT. Option 4D, S underscore user underscore STA. Question, during maintenance of role you notice that the status text for an authorization object indicates status changed new what does the status text mean? Option 1 The authorization object was used to create a new authorization because the value contained in SU24 differ from the SAP standard contained in SU25. Option 2 The authorization object must be maintained again. Option 3 This authorization object has been flagged as critical object. Option 4 The authorization object was used to create a new authorization because the initial configuration of the role change a default value maintained in SU24. Question, which of the following describe the behavior of a reference user when assigned to a user master record? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 The reference user roles are directly assigned to the user master record. Option 2 The roles of the reference user are always hidden. Option 3 The roles of the reference user can be shown. Option 4 The user master record references the role and authorizations assigned to the reference user. Question, which of the following accurately describes solution manager functionality? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 SAP SOS self-service is a convenient entry point to introduce security monitoring. Option 2 A system recommendation provide a work list of potentially relevant security notes. Option 3 configuration validation can check if security policies were applied. Option 4 SAP AVA provides the most comprehensive security check. Option 5 Configuration Validation helps to standardize and harmonize security related configuration items for ABAP systems only. Question Which authorization is required to modify authorization data of derived roles? Option 1 S underscore user underscore AGR. Option 2 S underscore user underscore SYS. Option 3 S underscore user underscore AUT. Option 4 S underscore user underscore VAL. Question, which transaction code allows you to configure the SAP system audit log? Option 1 SM20. Option 2 SM19. Option 3 SM18. Option 4 SUIM. Question, which Tater service object type includes business functional authorization objects used within the OData execution? Option 1 IWSG. Option 2 IWSC. Option 3 OSOD. Option 4 IWSV. Question, which of the following are system security threats? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Authority violation. Option 2 Non-repudiation. Option 3 Code injection. Option 4 System penetration. Option 5 Availability.
question, which Yukon phase blocks the access to RFC function modules without an assigned communication assembly. Option 1 Configuration Option 2 Logging Option 3 Activation Option 4 Evaluation Question, you want to limit an authorization administrator so that they can only assign certain authorizations. Which authorization object should you use? Option 1 S underscore user underscore val. Option 2 S underscore user underscore ADM. Option 3 S underscore user underscore AGR. Option 4 S underscore user underscore TCD. Question, which of the following illustrate the simplification of users and role maintenance on SAP Cloud? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 Business roles are automatically provisioned. Option 2 Business users have business roles. Option 3 Templates are provided for role derivation. Option 4 Read and write access can be restrict. Question, which ABAP transaction codes are relevant for SNC parameter configuration? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 Tink Wizard. Option 2 Strust. Option 3 Tink Config. Option 4 SNCO. Question, which of the following describes an authorization object class? Option 1 It defines a logical grouping of authorization objects. Option 2 It defines authorizations for different authorization objects. Option 3 It defines a group of 1 to 10 authorization field together. Option 4 It defines smallest unit against which an authorization check can be run. Question, which CDs related repository object types are provided with ABAP CDs? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1, SQL view. Option 2, data definition. Option 3, metadata extensions. Option 4, CDs view entity. Option 5, access control. Question, which of the following phases in SAP audit management auditing process? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Mitigation Review. Option 2 Engagement Planning. Option 3 Remediation Analysis. Option 4 Communication Results. Option 5 Monitoring Progress. Question, when you are troubleshooting an application start issue, what does the search startable application in roles report help you determine? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 if the PFCG roles contains all the start authorizations required for the application. Option 2 if the PFCG menu contains SAP Fiori tile group. Option 3 if there is an application start lock. Option 4 if the PFCG roles assigned to end user. Question, what content can be shared between SAP Access Control and SAP Cloud Identity and Access Governance products? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Mitigations. Option 2 Process Hierarchy. Option 3 Mitigation Control. Option 4 Risk Library. Option 5 Emergency Access. Question, 
What is the purpose of SAP notes listed by SAP Solution Manager System Recommendations? Note. There are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 to recommend SAP Hot News Notes, Priority 1 and 2. Option 2 to recommend legal change notes related to SAP innovations. Option 3 to recommend performance notes to improve system response. Option 4 to recommend SAP security notes for evaluation. Question, which of the various protocols can be used to establish secure communication? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 from secure login server to LDAP server, HTTPS, SSL. Option 2 from secure login server to SAP NetWeaver, RFC, SNC. Option 3 from business explorer to SAP NetWeaver, diagram slash RFC, SNC, HTTPS, SSL. Option 4 from secure login client to secure login server, diagram slash RFC, SNC, HTTPS, radius. Option 5 from SAP GUI to SAP NetWeaver, Diagram slash RFC, SNC. Question, you want to adjust check indicator values for certain authorization object delivered by SAP. In which of the following tables should your adjustments be recorded? Option 1 USOPX underscore C. Option 2 Yosabt underscore C. Option 3 Yosabash. Option 4 Yosabx. Question, which configuration options apply to the usage of vClient in the parameter ICM slash server underscore port underscore XX? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 V client default value is 0. Option 2 V client value must be specified if SSL configuration is defined by SL config. Option 3 V client default value is 1. Option 4 V client equals 0, which notifies the SSL server that no SSL client verification is needed. Option 5 V client equals 1 the server asks the client to transfer a certificate. Question, which of the following defines phishing? Option 1 overloading an application with request. Option 2 acquiring sensitive information by masquerading as trustworthy entity. Option 3 modifying an IP address of the source of the TCP slash IP packet. Option 4 pretending to be another user. Question, what is the main purpose of SAP Access Control, as an enterprise software solution? Option 1 Manage corporate social media presence. Option 2 Secure authentication for cloud and on-premise. Option 3 Identify security risk and document compliance. Option 4 Deployment of encryption services. Question, the report search for application in role menu can be called via which of the following options? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 transaction SUIM, menu node roles. Option 2 transaction RSSR underscore role underscore menu. Option 3 transaction RSSR underscore start underscore APPL. Option 4 transaction SUIM, menu node change documents. Question, how can you protect a system when you do not want the user assignments for a role to be transported? 
Option 1 Restrict access to the user assignment tab in PFCG in the target system. Option 2 Restrict import of users in table PRGN underscore CUST in the target system. Option 3 Restrict import of users in table PRGN underscore CUST in the development system. Option 4 Restrict access to the user assignment tab in PFCG in the development system. Question, which of the following features are provided by the SAP Fiori Launchpad Content Manager? Note. There are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Activate Zero Data Services. Option 2 Create and Configure Groups. Option 3 Create and Configure Catalogs. Option 4 Display the issue with SAP Fiori Launchpad Content. Option 5 Display Role Assignments for Catalogs. Question, which of the following authorization objects are used to secure the execution of external commands when a defining a background job step? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 s underscore log underscore com. Option 2 s underscore program. Option 3 s underscore btch underscore ext. Option 4 s underscore rzl underscore adm. Question, which feature is available in the common crypto lib scenario provided by SAP Security Library? Option 1 Hardware Security Model, HSM. Option 2 SPNIGO slash ABAP. Option 3 SSL slash TLS. Option 4 Secure Store and Forward, SSF. Question, your company uses derived roles. During maintenance of the plant manager imparting role, you add a new transaction to the menu tab which introduces a new organizational level that will be unique for each of your 150 plants. How will the new organization level be maintained in the derived roles? Option 1 Automatically using the copy data button during maintenance of the imparting role. Option 2 All at once using transaction massival. Option 3 Automatically after generating the profiles of the imparting role and adjusting the derived roles. Option 4 Manually by maintaining each derived role individually. Question, which of the following actions correctly describes the usage of backchannel single sign-on based on SAML 2.0? Option 1 The service provider get the authentication request from the identity provider over a SOAP channel. Option 2 The service provider queries the user for authentication credentials. Option 3 The identity provider get the authentication response from the service provider over a SOAP channel. Option 4 The service provider redirects the user to an identity provider and includes a SAML artifact referring to authentication request. Question, which of the following items are addressed by configuration validation? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Database parameters. Option 2 Critical roles. Option 3 Failed transport. Option 4 Software packages. Option 5 RFC logins. Question, what information can be provided by an audit class? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Dialog Logon. Option 2 RFC slash CPIC Logon. Option 3 Transaction Start. Option 4 User Roles. Option 5 User Authorizations.
question, what is the purpose of securing sensitive business data? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Reduction of training cost. Option 2 Protection of intellectual property. Option 3 Correctness of data. Option 4 Disruption of software deployment. Option 5 Protection image. Question, where you can enable read access logging tools. Option 1 SICF. Option 2 SPRO. Option 3 SWI5. Option 4 SUIM. Question, which archiving object can you use for archiving changed documents related to changes with authorizations assigned to user? Option 1 us underscore prof. Option 2 us underscore off. Option 3 us underscore pass. Option 4 us jj sir. Question, you are responsible for determining the reason why you need personal data and how this data is processed or stored. What key role do you play under GDPR in relation to personal data? Option 1 Data Steward Option 2 Data Controller Option 3 Data Subject Option 4 Data Processor Question, which of the following accurately describes the role slash profile SAP underscore new? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 The SAP underscore new must be generated in accordance with the system environment using the report regenerate underscore SAP underscore new. Option 2 The profile SAP underscore new provides authorizations to all new objects and objects change by release. Option 3 The role SAP underscore new does not guarantee backward capability for all scenarios. Option 4 Organizational levels to be maintained in profile SAP underscore new. Question, which of the following authorization objects would be required to allow back-end server access to a Webden Pro application using the SAP Fiori Launchpad? Option 1 S underscore code. Option 2 S underscore start. Option 3 S underscore service. Option 4 S underscore personas. Question. In SAP S slash 4 HANA Cloud authorization objects are grouped into which item? Option 1 Groups Option 2 Privileges Option 3 Single Technical Roles Option 4 Business Roles Question, which is the frequency of SAP patch day? Option 1 monthly. Option 2 yearly. Option 3 weekly. Option 4 quarterly. Question, which of the following actions are correctly describes the usage of front channel single sign-on based on SAML 2.0? Note. There are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 The identity provider queries the user for authentication credentials. Option 2 The identity provider presents the requested resource to the user. Option 3 The identity provider returns the user to service providers with an authentication request. Option 4 The service provider queries the user for authentication credentials. Question, 
which of the following core principle of GDP are? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Data Quality Option 2 Lawfulness, Fairness, and Transparency Option 3 Data Archiving Option 4 Data Minimization Option 5 Storage Limitation Question, which of the following transaction allows you to define role assignments for zero data services that are available on multiple back-end systems? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 slash if and slash maint underscore service. Option 2 slash if and slash gw underscore sys underscore alias. Option 3 slash if and slash gw underscore client. Option 4 slash UI2 slash GW underscore main underscore SRV. Question, your company uses derived roles. During maintenance of the plant manager imparting role, you add a new transaction to the menu tab which introduces a new organizational level that will be unique for each of your 150 plants. How will the new organization level be maintained in the derived roles? Option 1 Automatically using the copy data button during maintenance of the imparting role. Option 2 All at once using transaction massable. Option 3 Automatically after generating the profiles of the imparting role and adjusting the derived roles. Option 4 Manually by maintaining each derived role individually. Question, during maintenance of role you notice that the status text for an authorization object indicates status changed new what does the status text mean? Option 1 the authorization object was used to create a new authorization because the value contained in SU24 differ from the SAP standard contained in SU25. Option 2 the authorization object must be maintained again. Option 3 this authorization object has been flagged as critical object. Option 4 The authorization object was used to create a new authorization because the initial configuration of the role change a default value maintained in SU24. Question, which of the following are the examples of personal data under the GDPR? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 IP address. Option 2 email address. Option 3 GPS data from cellular phone. Option 4 age group. Option 5 aggregated statistics on the use of a product. Question, which of the following allows you to improve the quality of your enterprise data assets with consistent data validation rules, data profiling and metadata management? Option 1 SAP Information Steward. Option 2 SAP Process Control. Option 3 SAP Information Life Cycle Management. Option 4 SAP Data Services. Question, which transaction codes are relevant to enable SNC between ABAP system? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 RZ10. Option 2 SNCO. Option 3 Strust. Option 4 PFCG. Option 5 SU01. Question, 
which of the following accurately describes solution manager functionality? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 SAP SOS self-service is a convenient entry point to introduce security monitoring. Option 2 A system recommendation provide a work list of potentially relevant security notes. Option 3 configuration validation can check if security policies were applied. Option 4 SAP AVA provides the most comprehensive security check. Option 5 Configuration Validation helps to standardize and harmonize security-related configuration items for ABAP systems only. Question, which of the following are SAP UI5 Fiori application types? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 Legacy. Option 2 Transactional. Option 3 Analytical. Option 4 Webden Pro. Question, in the case of missing OData authorizations, why is it not recommended to maintain S underscore service manually within an SAP Fiori authorization role? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 The SRV underscore name value of the S underscore service authorization object is the hash value of an OData service. Option 2 The SRV underscore name value of the S underscore service authorization object is the name of an OData service. Option 3 Both front end and back end entries are generating the same S underscore service authorization object with different authorization values. Option 4 Both front end and back end entries are generating the same S underscore service authorization object with same authorization values. Question, you want to limit an authorization administrator so that they can only assign certain authorizations. Which authorization object should you use? Option 1 S underscore user underscore val. Option 2 S underscore user underscore ADM. Option 3 S underscore user underscore AGR. Option 4 S underscore user underscore TCD. Question, the DBMS tab in Transactions SU01 allows you to manage database privilege assignments for which of the following scenarios? Note, there are two correct answer to this question. Option 1 when users need to use reporting authorizations on SAP BW. Option 2 when a user needs to run applications that access database directly. Option 3 when users need 1 colon 1 user mapping to map analytical privileges of database to the virtual analysis of authorization on SAP BW. Option 4 when a user needs to execute CD's views. Question. What content can be shared between SAP Access Control and SAP Cloud Identity and Access Governance products? Note, there are three correct answer to this question. Option 1 Mitigations. Option 2 Process Hierarchy. Option 3 Mitigation Control. Option 4 Risk Library. Option 5 Emergency Access. Question, which of the following authorization objects would be required to allow back-end server access to a Webden Pro application using the SAP Fiori Launchpad? Option 1 S underscore code. Option 2 S underscore start. Option 3 S underscore service.
Option 4S underscore personas. Thank you for attending the session. I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Also feel free to ask your questions in the comment section below and we will reply to them at the earliest.